We begin tonight with a fight brewing between the North County and a county community over a possible mental health and addiction treatment site. Fox 5 Sarah Allegra joining us live now from Vista with more on this proposal for Green Oak Ranch. Sarah. Hi, Zara. Yeah, the city of Vista, as well as a local nonprofit in the county, are all fighting for this land right here in Vista. It's going to cost around $12 million, just the land itself. It's a major purchase, and with it has come some controversy. Our funding is at risk. Nestled in the hills of Vista, you'll find Green Oak Ranch. It's a secluded but serene space known for summer camps, its RV park, and a quaint refuge for sober living. We have a nine-month drug and alcohol recovery program and a six-month transitional living program. Hannah Gailey manages 28 acres of the 140-acre property. She runs a recovery ministry on site. But now the $12 million land that her facility sits on is up for sale, meaning... Anyone that purchases Green Oak Ranch and changes it will threaten 85% of the income. It's a spot nonprofit solutions for change the city of Vista and the county is all vying for. Still right now we're confused on what the county's plan is. The county specifically is hoping to buy 110 acres for sober housing and a behavioral health treatment hub. The site will also neighbor homes and schools, something concerning for resident and firefighter Tim Trinconi. I know the reality of these facilities and how devastating they are for the local community around them, the businesses around them. Supervisor Jim Desmond is behind the proposal. He says if the county gets the property, the space could host around 200 people in a variety of treatment and residential programs. He says his vision is focused on treatment and healing, not shelters, parking lots, or any housing first proposals. The site could cost the county over 300 million. We need these things desperately. We had a 969 person increase in the number of unsheltered homeless people people in our county. But still, Vista Mayor John Franklin would like the city to buy the land instead of the county, touting a community-centric solution rather than a broader county approach. And to serve them in the neighborhoods that they currently are living in, where they have friends, they have family, they have networks, they have transportation and other services already there to serve them. Now, I do want to emphasize that that homeless nonprofit Solutions for Change is also in the running now. They say they were a little surprised to learn about the county's proposal and that they were told that they're one of the leading candidates when it comes to purchasing and acquiring this land. Now, as far as the city of Vista goes, tomorrow evening they are going to host a closed session meeting when it comes to potentially buying this property here as well. So those discussions will be had tomorrow and hoping to learn more about where they will decide to go with this purchase then. For now, that's the very latest here from Vista. Sarah Allegra, Fox 5 News. Sarah Allegra, thanks so much for that report tonight.